did you did you just heal? Like when did it stop? You know, and, and did you probably go through steps of healing, yeah. um, you know, to just make you who you are today? Yeah. Yes. Okay, uh, I, I wouldn't say it. Uh, I healed, mm -hmm. uh, like, completely. Okay. Because uh, what I was going through would repeat itself mm -hmm. almost oh, always. Oh, 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 oh. And I'm this kind of person who will make very tough decisions. Mm -hmm. So I said to myself, mm -hmm. now that I brought myself here, mm -hmm. and my dad told me, Mumelia, wende ulijitafutia shida ni yako hiyo ikizidi utakuja nyumbani but please don't come when everything has not messed up yeah so i was like waiting for the the time everything will mess up yeah that is when i go back you go back yeah unfortunately my mother was a pillar to me and i lost her so i was like ha now, how do Who I go about this? To? Who else do I turn to? Mm. What do I do? Mm. And uh, by the time I lost my mother, uh, I, I had decided to leave. Mm. Okay. And uh, I decided I'll leave and I'll not tell my people. Mm. I'll, I'll just go into hiding. Mm. So when I decided to leave because, um, okay, there, there was a, a point he came and told me now, I want to change like completely. completely. Because of my age, mm. we're getting older, mm. children, children are growing, we need to, to, to shape up for their future and everything. He would reason very well. Mm. So he stopped drinking. Mm. And he told me, now you know what? Uh, I want us to get to that child. Oh, wow. And he stopped Kabisa. Yeah. So I was like, okay. Now everything has it's changed. Okay. This is the change I was looking for. Mm -hmm. Little did I know mm -hmm. that was to be the worst now. Because uh, eventually I conceived mm -hmm. and I got my third bone. Child, yeah. After getting my third bone, uh, we had some like eight, nine months. Mm -hmm. Very well. Everything was good. We were at peace. And then he went back to drinking again. Mm. So I asked him, what have you decided what again? Changed? Why, why this kind of traumatic change? Now we, we had started planning things and organizing mm. ourselves very well. Mm. So, and I, I had already lost my mother. Mm. So me, I thought now that um, things have changed, I think I'll live for good. Mm. Yeah. yeah, I will live for good. But again, here the kids are telling me, Mommy, you know what? Tukitoka hapa siya tuwezi to daddy. Wow. That was my son. Yeah. My daughter loved the grandmother and the dad so much. Mm. But I decided either way, I'll go. So I, I left mm. and I went into hiding. Mm. I went to a very far place in Oloitok Tok. Mm -hmm. And uh, he looked for me everywhere. He couldn't find me. He followed my people, my aunts, all my relatives, and mm -hmm. he couldn't find me, Kabisa. Mm -hmm. So, finally, he came to my sister, mm -hmm. my elder sister, and told her, please tell me where my wife is. If you don't, I'm not leaving here. Mm -hmm. I'll stay here until you tell me. If she died, I'll go look for her body and bury her. Mm -hmm. Because on that, I, I, I wouldn't love another woman. Mm. So please, if you care about me, tell me tell where me she is. Yeah. And my sister was like, hey, I, you know, he, he may decide to commit suicide yeah. because he was so serious about that. Mm. And uh, my sister told her, told him, please try look for her at like, Tok Tok. That is the only place you have not visited. Yeah. If you find her, well, okay. if you don't, then I don't know where she could yeah. be. Did he come? He did. And found you? Yeah. Okay. So when he found me, he told me, now you know what? I want us to go back home. All right. Give me the last chance. Okay. I will change. And it's now 19 years. Okay? Mm -hmm. So I asked him, are you going to change? Mm -hmm. 
I think you're a chameleon for lack of a better word. Okay. All right. Let's fast forward because we have like two minutes. Yeah. So he changed. Y y you've told me you'll change. You've mm -hmm. kept telling me you're changing, you're changing until now. Mm -hmm. And now my son is almost getting into high school. Yeah. Please. He told me, okay, forgive me for the last time. Let's go back home and uh, uh, you'll, you'll know I've changed. Mm -hmm. So I told him, okay. You just go, I'll come later. Yeah. He said, no, I'm not going. I'm not leaving. To a point, he went to my sister's pastor mm. and told him, you are, you, you are, your member is withholding my wife. Mm. And she has her husband. You also have your wife. Yeah. So please tell her to release my wife. Okay. I want to go back home with her. Right. And so my sister told, told him, please... I'm not the parent. Mm -hmm. She has her parents. Okay. The dad is at home. Mm -hmm. Please go back home. Tell dad to call her. I'll release her. I'll release her. Okay. Case. All right. So, Literally 30 seconds to end the show. <laughs> <laughs> and I need Jeff to also conclude this. Uh, so first of all, to you are here. Did he change? Did he not? And okay. Yeah. He, he changed. Mm -hmm. The time I came back. Okay. He changed. Yeah. And uh, as the change progressed, mm. that is when I lost him. Oh, I'm sorry. So when I lost him, uh, it was another journey because mm -hmm. I was already hurt. Yeah. And I've started healing. Healing. And then, and then he leaves. Him. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm just sorry. left. And so yeah. uh, I, I, I had this healing journey mm -hmm. from uh, what I had gone through and to then the death, really which was very traumatic. Yeah. yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. And Jeff, very briefly, um, you said you were not affected.